My friends, uh, those men are not attired from, for some mystic ceremonial, as you might imagine there. They are expert swordsmen, experts in a very ancient oriental sport, if you can call it a sport. It's, a, it's unmatched for ferocity and for speed and for skill. Believe me, I've never seen its equal. I don't want you to miss one second of this. Now, they shortly will duel because of Miss Catherine Rush of Los Angeles asked for it. Here's what she said to Mr. Baker last week. I saw a picture in the paper of two Japanese kendo, K-E-N-D-O, fighters. Kendo is a way of fencing in Japan. And a friend of mine who saw them do this in Tokyo wrote me how extremely exciting and skilled this sport is. And I'm asking, if possible, to see a kendo duel on your show, if possible. Sign, Catherine Rush. Well, Miss Rush, because you asked for it, a kendo duel, we shall see. I would like to present to you these experts. To your left is Toro Mori. He is former kendo champion of Japan, and by the way now is the 1952 Olympic fencing coach for the Japanese team. Next to me is Toshiro Izumi, who is the is challenger for kendo right now, the up, outstanding one, and lives in our country. I would like to briefly ex describe these garments, as they told me. They probably were designed centuries ago and have never been changed in design. Uh, this cloth, as you see here, a very heavy padding on the wrist and the hand. And here in the hip section, this cloth is woven from a thread that is practically like a rope and very tough. Uh, the breastplate is a heavy leather, which is polished, and inside is lined with a steel-hardened bamboo, split bamboo. The same here for the uh, shoulders and for the throat, and up here lined with bamboo inside, and of course the fencer's mask in front. Now, their swords or sticks are also, by some process, hardened bamboo, split bamboo. Now, uh, these gentlemen will now uh, give us a demonstration of kendo, in which they will demonstrate all of the defense and of the offense in this without stopping when a point is scored. It's rather complicated, but if you have a very quick eye and watch this tremendously quick action, you can see a point scored and count them yourself. Uh, a point is scored when it's hit upon the head or either side of the head, or either side of the waist, uh, upon the wrist, or a thrust here at the throat. Gentlemen, are you prepared? And guard. to count the hits. I don't know. <clears throat> they uh, give quite an assistance to the referee here. Uh, those uh, cries of anguish uh, were saying in Japanese, I am hit, which the referee can hear and counts up the score in that way. It's a terrific competition. Believe me, if you can call it a sport, it's more like mayhem, gentlemen. We appreciate your answering this request. You put up a very good battle, sir. And we would say that the Japanese uh, fencing team for the Olympics is in very good hands. Thank you. We thank you both for showing us kendo through kendo through television in the United States here. And to letter writer uh, Miss Catherine Rush of Los Angeles, you gave us a lot of real action-filled moments because you asked for it. <laughs>